Hey, what's going on, guys? The Horror Man back on day 16 of Monster Mayhem with my review of Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman. They did the mash. They did the monster. Mayhem. Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman was released in 1943. And as you can see, I also own this one on VHS. Remember the excitement when Freddy vs. Jason was announced? Well, Universal did it first with Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman. I believe this was the first horror movie to feature two horror icons in the same film. And not only are they in the same film, but they actually battle at the end. Interestingly, Lon Chaney Jr., who played Frankenstein's monster in the previous Frankenstein film, The Ghost of Frankenstein, reprises his role as Larry Talbot, or the Wolfman, in this. Bella Lugosi, who played Igor in the previous two Frankenstein movies, takes over the role of Frankenstein's monster in Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman. With this film, three universal horror icons have played that role. It's also funny because these two actors were in the previous Frankenstein movie together. In The Ghost of Frankenstein, Lon Chaney Jr. plays the monster, while Bella Lugosi plays Igor. As for the synopsis, Larry Talbot has been dead for years, or so everyone thinks. His body was buried in the family crypt. But then, on the night of a full moon, some grave robbers dig him up. Their intention was to steal from the crypt, but they didn't realize they'd be unleashing the Wolfman. Now, back from his grave, the Wolfman continues his killing spree on the night of the full moon. Poor Larry himself, though, is not a killer, and he never was. He just can't control himself when he transforms. Desperate to put an end to his eternal life, he seeks assistance from the gypsy woman in the original The Wolfman. I love that she also returns in this sequel. She believes that the one person that can help Larry is Dr. Frankenstein. But when they arrive in town, they learn that the doctor is dead. His monster is still alive, however, and Larry finds him, releasing him from his grave. This allows Frankenstein's monster to also continue his killing spree. The difference is the Wolfman wants to die once and for all, while the monster wants to live forever. In the end, it becomes a destructive battle between the two in an exciting climax. This movie is really awesome. It has everything you could want and more in a Universal Monster Classic. I mean, not only do we get Frankenstein's monster, but we get the Wolfman too. Like I said in my review of The Wolfman, Larry Talbot may be my favorite character in all of the Universal Classic Monster movies. I like that he's just a decent guy with a curse. Meanwhile, it was also cool seeing Bela Lugosi in the role of the monster. Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman has the gorgeous atmosphere from both of the original films. I love that there are literally two killing sprees taking place at the same time. And the final battle between the two is better than you probably imagine. Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman is like the ultimate universal monster classic. Have you seen it? If so... What do you think of it? Comment below and let me know. And please be sure to check out Jason's review. And of course, head back tomorrow for Day 17 of Universal Monster Mayhem. Until then, thanks for watching guys. Hit that thumbs up and be kind, subscribe. <laughs>